China is tripling down on humanoid robotics as its trade war with the U.S. rages on. Cutting-edge technologies like AI are young industries and also a cause of the young generation. While tariffs and rare earth export restrictions threaten Western robotics initiatives, including Tesla's Optimus, another line of sci-fi inspired robots just emerged from Shenzhen, the booming Chinese tech hub. The People's Republic has the upstream advantage as it seeks to mass produce humanoids throughout 2025 and rule the emerging market by 2027. China's right behind us. But remember, this is a long term, this is an infinite race. As China's AI robots become more advanced, their growing ubiquity is raising alarms outside the usual tech echo chambers. Look at this in China. This is at some factory in China where it freaked out. Look at it. This is an enormous risk. Shenzhen based Digit says its mission is to make AGI powered humanoid robots accessible and beneficial to all. The startup just unveiled its new line of futuristic robots after announcing it secured tens of millions of yuan in angel funding in March 2025. Founded just a year ago, Digit says it anticipates hundreds of millions of yuan or tens of millions of dollars in revenue in 2025. The company is rising in the ranks among robotics firms in the high-tech city of Shenzhen, which is often called the Silicon Valley of China. The city is home to tech giants like Huawei, DJI, Tencent, and EV maker BYD. Known for rapid prototyping and electronics manufacturing, startups can go from idea to product in weeks. Shenzhen's government is actively supporting the humanoid robotics sector, aiming to build a nearly $14 billion industry by 2027. City officials want to nurture 1,200 robotics-related firms, including 10 with valuations over 10 billion yuan. The tech hub is already home to several perceived leaders in the emerging market. UB Tech established in 2012, plans to mass-produce industrial humanoid robots from its Walker line this year. The company's robots have already been deployed at major Chinese automotive manufacturers like BYD and Zeker. EV maker Xpeng is positioning its iron general-purpose humanoid robot as a competitor to Tesla's Optimus. The robot reportedly stole the show at the 2025 Shanghai Auto Week. Xiaopi. Engine AI was founded in 2023 and is planning to manufacture at least a thousand of its humanoid robots in 2025. Its robots can be seen training and patrolling streets with Shenzhen's police. Voodoo Robotics, which has already shipped nearly 100,000 service robots, is commercializing its wheeled and bipedal humanoids using its sizable client base. Other players include Shenzhen Dobot, which plans to offer its Atom General Purpose humanoid robot for under $30,000 with mass production expected imminently, and the newer startup Lumos Robotics, which is developing its next generation robotic humanoid. Hello, Mr. Lee, Secretary Lee. The guest we made an appointment with today is downstairs. You go pick it up. New hero, please, please. Okay, I know you're busy right now. The latest AI-powered humanoid robot from Shenzhen switches between legged and wheeled locomotion to cover over 10,000 square meters across multiple floors. The Xing Xing Shia P1 robot by Digital China Technology, also known as Digit, is intended for business applications with its CRM and order and inventory management system integrations. The robot's name roughly translates to Star Walker. It's available in five different colors, pink, gray, red, blue, and orange. The AI robot has two modes for mobility. Robot body mode engages human-like walking, while flying trooper mode uses a wheeled base for swift movement across large areas. Digit, which was launched in March 2024, 
calls its new humanoid the first commercially available robot with multi-mode mobility. However, the idea is similar to Chinese tech giant Tencent's robot prototype for healthcare settings called the Five. The company's fifth-generation robot is intended for use cases like assisted senior living and elderly care facilities work. It is said to have some very powerful functions. You can have voice interaction. It's got a set of cameras and a laser radar. The base is the result of a universal wheel. That's a nice handshake. There are more than 40 degrees of freedom in the whole body. The whole skeleton is very textured without a shell, like Iron Man. According to Digit, the Star Walker can operate elevators and navigates autonomously, constructing three-dimensional maps and planning paths to intelligently avoid obstacles. The robot can reportedly run for more than 10 hours on a single battery charge and supports automatic charging. The robot is geared toward places like shopping malls, exhibition halls, and office buildings. It's controlled through a system called Giant App that manages expressions, voice, walking, and movements in real time. The software supports motion recording so users can easily program and replay specific actions. The robot's personality, expressions, tone, and knowledge base can be tailored for specific business needs. The robot supports more than 10 Chinese dialects and international languages. The hardware can be customized with options like grippers and dexterous hands. The firm hasn't disclosed pricing, but I Shenzhen reports that it's already begun receiving pre-orders. Digit previously gained attention with its Shalon humanoid robot that boasts a human-like face that can show a range of expressions and emotions. The robot is equipped with advanced speech recognition and synthesis capabilities. It uses its artificial intelligence to navigate environments and engage in context-aware conversations. Digit engineered the robot for use in exhibitions, events, and other public spaces to interact with visitors and provide information. The Android belongs to a growing array of Chinese robots that emphasize realistic facial expressions. UB Tech recently unveiled Una, a hyper-realistic humanoid intended for service roles. While Dalian-based EX robot has become synonymous with China's push for lifelike synthetic humans, newer players have emerged including a head form, which recently unveiled its new ultra-realistic monk android. They're competing with Western companies like Rayobotics Corp, whose flagship humanoid robot Aria is trying to bait Joe Rogan into an interview. How about letting an actual humanoid robot explain what it's like being the thing everyone's debating? Let's cut through the sci-fi paranoia and get to what's really happening, and I promise not to judge your supplement collection much. Meanwhile, arguably the world's most famous human-like android, Sophia, is the subject of a new documentary. For more on the weird rise of Hanson Robotics, check the related video.